We sing and shout on Sundays. But are we bearing fruit on Mondays? We sing praises on Sunday. But what happens when that person cuts us off on the on ramp? Are we bearing fruit? <laughs> I'm coming to you. Are we bearing fruit when they jump us in line at the snack station? Where my teens at? Are you bearing fruit? <laughs> What are, we, are we bearing fruit throughout the week? Not just on Sunday. We can all bear fruit on Sunday. Look, we got the facade going on. But Jesus is looking for real fruit. Colossians 1 says, Walk in a manner worthy of the Lord to please Him in all respects, bearing fruit in every good work and increasing in the knowledge of God. John 15, 16 says, You did not choose me, but I chose you and appointed you that you would go and bear fruit. We are to bear fruit. Jesus was making a statement. Because streets were flooded with people that were praising. And just a few days later, they would be yelling, crucify him. We could praise him on Sunday, but Monday through Saturday, we're yelling, crucify him with our actions. Church, are we just going through the motions? Or are we producing fruit? Are we winning souls? Are we, are we having our works of righteousness? Are we, are we giving? Are we praising? Or are we just putting on a facade? Verse 15 through 16, so they came to Jerusalem, and Jesus went to the temple and began to drive out those who bought and sold in the temple and overturned the tables. Jesus is looking for room in your life. He's looking for room in your life. Because they were turning their sanctuary into a place of spiritual prostitution. We got Sundays down. Things you do as a pastor. Because we got we can praise them on Sunday. We waving our palm branches, it's Palm Sunday, glory to God, Hosanna in the highest. But then we addicted to credit cards Monday through Saturday. We say we yell, crucify him. Monday or Sunday, we yell, praise him. Hosanna in the highest. Glory to God. He'll do it again. Surround me, O oh Lord. Then we worry about our stocks. We worry about our success. Monday through Saturday. Hosanna in the highest on Sunday, but come Monday through Saturday, how my social status? How many likes did I have on my Insta story? Did anybody swipe up or swipe right or swipe left? <laughs> Glory to God. Crucify him. We take a communion on Sunday. We have something else on Monday through Saturday. Well, Pastor, I was told that I wasn't supposed to get drunk. As long as I can drink, as long as I wasn't drunk, I'm all right. Let me ask you a question. How many beers does it take to get you drunk? I'm don't answer. Ten. So if you take one beer, then you're one tenth drunk. <laughs> Crucify him. Praise him on Sunday. Oh Lord. It's a cell phone box. I didn't have an extra old one to jam up or whatever. So but Monday through Saturday. We're more worried about this. We're not making room. We're not making room for Jesus through the week. We make room for our Sunday. We got our pretty clothes on. We got our hair did up. We got our nails done. We got our pumps on. We got it all going together on Sunday. We got it together. But Monday through Saturday, we live in our hell because we don't get room for Jesus. We got addictions and we just... I tell the pastor I'm delivered on Sunday. But come Thursday, I feel like I need another hit. We have an intimacy with Jesus on Sunday. And we have an intimacy with Jessica as long as she's, not, if she's your wife. You have intimacy with her. <laughs> Every other day. I'm just being real. Praise him on Sunday. Crucify him on Wednesday. Praise him 
on Sunday. Glory to God, this is so old. But you know what? I praised him on Sunday. I can look at that. I can look at that website one more time. It'd be all right. I can actually give you this on Sunday. Crucify him! Crucify him! Jesus said it. Jesus said it on Sunday. Oh, what's this? Kendrick Lamar. You're the moral to the story. You're endorsing MF or I don't even like you. Corrupt a man's heart with a gift. That's how you find out who you're dealing with. Crucify him. Oh, what's this? Havana. My heart is in Havana. Havana. Oh, no, no. Jeffrey just graduated. Fresh on campus. Mm, fresh out of East Atlanta with no manners. D. Fresh out of East Atlanta. Bump on her bumper like a traffic jam. Hey, I was quick to pay that girl like I was saying. Here you go, eh? Back at home, Shawnee. Crave it on me. Get digging on me. She waited on me. Then what? Shawnee taking on me. Got the bacon on me. You're laughing now, but you're crying. Crucify him. Jesus said it. Jesus, from the top of my head to the soles of my feet, felt the spirit moving all over me on Sunday. No, you're always on the night shift, but I can't stand these nights alone, and I don't need no explanation, because, baby, you're the boss at home. You don't got to go to work, 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 work. <laughs> yes, you do. <laughs> Make some money, you got to go to work. Hosanna in the highest praise Jesus. He'll do it again on Sunday. Then we crucify him. Monday through Saturday. Jesus is going to flip the papers in the church house again. It's time to clean out some room for Jesus.